Hello again, YouTubers and Pokemon fans. It is 54 degrees in Wisconsin here today. Sun is out, the breeze is nearly non-existent. I'm in a t-shirt and I think you can see their shorts. I got glare on the screen, it's hard for me to see, but I'm gonna turn a lucky egg on here once I get onto the campus here, sitting over college. Uh, try to catch some more Jello Pokemon that I haven't caught yet. I didn't want to catch new ones without the lucky egg on because I need the XP, man. I need it bad. Uh, we're at level 25. Hopefully it's level 26 before too long. I think we need to go up 108,000 more. I'll show you our XP before we start the lucky egg. Um, and do any focus stops or catches up today. Today is day seven. So I'll get double XP on the day seven bonus as well. So I won't yap too long here. Let's just turn the lucky egg on and yeah. Uh, let's see what happens, shall we? All right, so here's the canvas we're about to go on to. A couple of lures, three lures on so far, looks like. And our starting XP, 16,243. Now I'll probably speed up a lot of this and not be talking, so it shouldn't be a 30 minute video, but we'll see what happens. Like I said, seven day streak stuff, so, ooh, we got King's Rock in all that, looks like. Very nice. Uh, I don't have anything to evolve into that right away, but still good to get that. And uh, let's start catching some stuff here, shall we? Ooh, I should've actually done a pineapple area there, because we're getting kind of close to a crow bat. Kind of close, kind of close. Got him. Seven day streak, there's more XP. So much XP. And that one disappeared. How rude of that ladybug to disappear like that. All right, well, let's jump in here and do an evolution or two real quick. We've got uh, just nine things ready to evolve because we just did a lucky egg a couple days ago, um, which you guys saw in our mm. previous video. Uh, so don't really have much to evolve, but Eh, maybe we'll catch a bunch of stuff. We'll see. Another Flareon. Not what I was hoping for, but oh well. Oh well. Ooh, very high. Well, our highest CP one, though, I think. Might be our highest period. Let's see. Alright. And if I stop talking randomly, it's because of people around and I feel awkward. And this Centret does not want to be caught, even though it's not a strong one. We have ones that are just in the 300 CP that are ready to evolve, actually. We'll be evolving two Centrets during this Lucky Egg, most likely. Oh, I guess this is a Ditto. How about that? That's our third Ditto ever. Alright. Ooh, Skarmory. That is a new one for us. That would be a new one. All right, let's go like this. Let's uh, go to Nab Bear, I guess, try that. And let's try an Ultra Ball. Still not used to the new uh, Pokeball mechanic. Skarmory, not an easy catch, it would seem. Let's try a regular raspberry here. Doesn't help that I'm throwing the balls too high, too hard, etc. Like I said, still not used to the new Pokeball mechanic. Try to lighten it up a little bit. There we go. We got a nice. Let's see if that does the trick here. I gotta try to keep on moving too. I don't think I'm gonna hatch any eggs. Um, during this, I think I'd have to go like a one and a half kilometers. I guess it's possible, but it'd only be a 2k egg, I believe. So there we go. Got him. New one for the Pokedex. Scummery. All right. Actually not super high on the CP range there. Keep spraying the Pokestops too. How are we on items? Because we got that bombardment. Oh, 17 shy. So we got, we got a ways to go. Got a ways to go. And see, on this one, we are going to go with a pineapple berry, because I would like to be able to get a mammoth swine during this. Let's go a great ball, too. 
Hopefully it stays in. I think the pineapple berry only works on the first ball thereafter, but I could be mistaken. Could be mistaken. Um, haven't really tried it yet. I always get on the first ball, it seems. So we get the six candy on that. And as you can see here, there's just a gaggle, a gaggle of centrets everywhere. Yeah, centret is definitely the new Rattata, where you see them everywhere, you don't really want to catch them. Um, there's no new Pokemon in Gen 2 that only take 12 candy to evolve, so there's no new Weedle, Caterpie, or uh, Pidgey. Uh, but there's a lot of new Rattatas, namely centret here, namely the centret. And there's another Swinub. Getting our pineapple berry ready here. And there's a real life squirrel right next to me here. Let's see if a Pokeball does it on this one. And if it doesn't, I'm not gonna throw another berry because I wanna see if we still get a double candy because I'm not sure. Again, I think it's only on the first ball you throw. Could be mistaken. Could be. <sighs> we shall see. Gotcha. Caught. Three. Yep, so it is only on the ball right after. So, I, if you use a pineapple berry, you'll probably want to use something better than a Pokeball. And uh, hope that you at least give yourself a chance to catch it. Because it'd be very unfortunate if you, you know, just miss all together. And uh, the ladybug can dart back and forth, left and right. Got the Pokeball thrown before it did, though. But I think I'll shop for a little bit here and let's just roam around, catch some stuff here, and I'll speed up the video for you for a bit here. All right, well, this would be our first Murkrow. Would be. Um, actually, no. Um, well, Murkrow, does it evolve in Gen 2? I don't know that it does. I can't remember. Yeah, like I said, you don't want to miss, but we did. We did. Oh, I can't use it again either. That's kind of lame. How about that? Oh, because... Okay, so if you miss, it doesn't count as your one throw. See? So the pineapple berry counts on the first landed throw, I guess we'll call it. So, broke free, so... And it ran. Oh, darn you, Murkrow. Darn you, darn you, darn you. Alright, back to speeding things up. All right, we've entered a zone of two lures here, and here would be our first Apom. Gotta catch some new Pokemon here. We got the Skarmory already, which is one we weren't really expecting, but obviously the more the merrier. Let's just go to the Great Box. We're getting low on Pokeballs, although we're spinning Pokestops regularly. We're also catching very, very regularly as well, so it is what it is. Stay in your, ah, oh. Raspberry, go. Great ball, go. Yeah, I, like I said, I need to readjust my Pokeball throw in here because pretty much all mine go too far, it seems. Because I've gotten more lofty now. But we got them. Took a few, but we got them. All that XP. Reg that to the Pokedex. And uh, Ambipom. Yep, that's not Gen 2. Like I've said before, um, I'm not good with generations as far as what Pokemon is what generation. It's just not my strong suit when it comes to Pokemon. Um, so, like, I think there's several evolutions that I know exist, but they're not in Gen 2. So, I'm trying to remember what's what. Not going that great for me, but it is what it is. It is what it is. Alright, let's, uh, I don't see anything else new on the radar, or at least pictured. So, catching a few things here that aren't that important. So, let's speed it up again for you. All right, here's another new one for us, hopefully, a not to. We're gonna go with a pineapple berry because it does evolve into Zatu. I doubt we'll get enough during this lucky egg, but one can hope. And I was able to shorten the throw enough there to get a great. So hopefully, hopefully it stays. And yes, we got it. First ball, first ball. Which now, if you don't know, it gives you extra XP as well. First throw, extra. So 1420 on that one. Nice. How many candy do we need? Is it 50? Yeah, it's 50. Pretty decent CP on that one anyway. 
All right, back to walking, back to walking. And here we have what would be our first hoot hoot. We'll use the pineapple berry. We'll use our last Pokeball. It's, it's week one at 49. 49 CP. We got the grate. That one breaks out. I'll be very, very surprised and disappointed as well. But anything's possible. I've seen, you know, 10 CP Pidgeys break out before. We got this one. We got this one. 1420. Rack up the CP now. I'm trying to think of what other new ones there are that I haven't got yet. I don't, don't have a hop up yet. I know that much. Um, spin rack and a Spiro. Yeah, see anything good on nearby here? Ooh, there's one. There's a Merrill, which is not too far. So uh, we'll try to get that one next then, I guess. All right, we found the Merrill. We found it. Let's go pineapple again. Here we go. Blue ball for a blue ball shaped Pokemon. Should do the trick, right? You'd hope, you'd hope. And got him, another one for the Pokedex. Doing well, doing well, 1320. And how many do we need for a Zoomerill? Uh, only 25, okay, well, if we get lucky, you never know, you never know. Look a ton, something I didn't see before the Valentine's Day event. Interesting. Let's evolve some new Pokemon here, shall we? Let's get our first ever Starmie. It's not the best IV bun, but we need to fill out this Pokedex. We need to get the experience points and then find better Pokemon later. I'm um, still not going to talk over all these probably, but I just know that these next few evolutions will include some brand new Pokemon for us. Look at that beautiful Starmie. Beautiful. This bell sprout we're gonna evolve straight to a victory bell. It's got eight level IVs, uh, no perfect IVs, but best bell sprout I've had in a while. We actually just hatched this in an egg, I think yesterday at the, uh, well, two days ago at the tail end of the video you guys saw on a Saturday. I don't know when this video is going live, but still, still. And that's actually not our strongest weeping bell, but it's uh, better IVs than our higher CP ones. So still all good, still all good. Here we go, our first stage two victory bell. I remember from the anime, always eating James, basically. Always funny, always funny. Very nice, victory bell. Victory is ours. All right, 1265, still not very strong. Let's see. We got another not two there. Maybe I'll be doing back-to-back -back lucky eggs or something here, I don't know, but. Well, we'll see where we're at when this one expires. We're down to like the last five minutes already, so it's going fast. It's going fast. I think this is our last evolution. We only got about a minute or left in Lucky Egg, I think, so we might be near Murkra, though. Might be. Might be. Well, let's see here. Come on, my bro. Mm. All right. Tracked him down. Tracked him down. Try a pineapple. This one's a lot weaker than the other one we had. The other one we found was like 800 something, so this one will hopefully be an easier one. And I still, still not positive if Honchkrow is the Johto Gen 2 or not. We'll see if we actually catch this guy. Oh boy. Honchkrow is a fighter. Honchkrow is a fighter. Or sorry, Murkrow, excuse me. Murkrow is a fighter. Honchkrow's probably gonna be a bigger fighter because it's the evolution. All right, we got him though, we got him though. 1240, register the Pokedex. 
There's a spot after him. And nope, does not evolve on here. All right, we're down to 38 seconds, so a focus stop and a catch here, and that'll probably be about all. And we did not put a very big dent in our leveling up to 26 there, it looks like, unfortunately. But it is what it is, it is what it is. And once the lucky egg expires here, um, I'll probably stop recording. Uh, and we'll just try to catch a bunch more stuff, get more evolutions lined up, maybe doing a lucky egg later today or tomorrow. We'll see, but it, we won't do it back to back. I feel like that will be, end up being wasteful. Cause I gotta see where everything's at here. Six, five, four, three. Yeah, nothing else here to catch at the moment. So, lucky egg expires. I think we were at 16,243. Is that what it was? Now we're at 64. So, we gained less than 50,000 XP during that. Uh, during lucky egg, the other day we gained over 6,000 XP. But that was very heavily evolution based. So, basically, if you wanna level up the fastest way with the lucky egg, is to have a bunch of evolutions. Uh, you can probably do about 50 evolutions, maybe more, while a lucky egg is on, at least 50. So if you can get at least 50 things ready to evolve before you turn lucky egg on, that'll probably get you your most bane for your buck on the lucky egg. Uh, but still, not too bad. We still need, what, another almost 130,000 more. So we basically have to have like two maxed out lucky eggs to get to level 26. So I'm going to do that by Monday. I'm recording this Sunday afternoon. It's 1.51 p.m. right now. So uh, 26, not happening at the moment, but hope you guys still enjoy that. Got a few new Pokemon, nothing new on the nearby list even, but hopefully we can track down some more. Uh, so until next time, thank you for watching. Subscribe if you haven't already. Rock smash that like button. Visit thepokegatecapital.com for all your Pokemon needs. Thank you all for watching, and I'll see you next time for some more Pokemon goodness. The journey continues.